This video is going to be a short review on the DVOOM Bluetooth speaker. So this is how you turn it on and so they have these six buttons here and this little joystick thing and they have a screen here which you can use to customize. Uh, I would probably compare it to a, like a very simple Amazon Echo or Google Nest Hub. So you can use it for a lot of random stuff. It charges via uh, USB-C and I usually just keep it plugged in on my desk. So you use this app right here, it's called DIVPIX and then um, from here you just make an account and then you link your device on here and you can do all the stuff on here. So you go to plus and then it'll look for your device. So there's very minimal instructions on how to actually use this app. So you kind of just have to play around with it. And um, so the main thing you can use this for is to just put a, like a cute background on. So if I choose this one, um, it'll pop up on here. You can see all the new backgrounds. You can see the top ones that users have made. And then uh, you can choose from this list and then you can put it on here. Like that one's cute and you can put it on there. If you go to discover, you can see all the different things you can do um, with the screen and there is a lot of random stuff. Uh, you can design your own background and animate it and put on whatever text you want. So you can design your own um, uh, backgrounds and you can animate them and make them move. You can type in a text. And it'll scroll through it, I guess. And then you can have like different effects that you want for the text. You can use it for like color by number. And then you can color. <laughs> I guess, um, but there's a lot of things that I wouldn't use this for. You can do music, but I mean, you can just Bluetooth it. These are just random songs that come with the app. Um, there's DJ Mixer, which is cool. You can just press different sounds. can leave a voice memo. Uh, you can chat with other people that have the app. You can set an alarm. Um, you can click sleep time and they actually have pretty nice sounds that you can put on while you're sleeping. And you can set a timer. Um, you can use it as a planner and plan your day and then I guess notifications pop up when it's time to do each thing. And then you can plan that out. Uh, you can play games on here. There's like Tetris, look flappy wings, snake, pixel dice. And I can use it uh, for a stopwatch, start, and then it'll just start the clock there. Um, you can use it uh, to give you notifications of days that you want. There's a countdown meter. Um, there's a noise meter. So it'll um, detect how loud it is. Hello? Um, there's a scoreboard if you want to use it to keep track of something. So you can use this for notifications, which is mainly what I use it for, I guess, because it looks cute when it pops up. So if you get like a text, 
like that'll pop up on the screen and then the actual text will kind of scroll through it in big letters which is kind of obnoxious but but you know it's cool like snapchat and then it'll just pop up on the screen which is cute Uh, if you go to channel, you can also change the color of your clock. Um, if you want the clock to be your background, you can change the color of this lighting background. Um, I don't know what that is. This is a visualizer when you're listening to songs, I guess. Um, and so it'll move according to the song. Uh, this is custom, so if you wanted to scroll through different backgrounds, uh, you can add a bunch of backgrounds that you want and it'll just, uh, oops, you can, it'll just cycle through um, the backgrounds that you want. It's a pretty nice Bluetooth speaker too. Turn it the loud. the Christmas tree. It's pretty loud. Overall, I'd say it's just a pretty cute accessory to have on your desk. Um, again, I mainly use it for probably the clock and notifications and uh it's a pretty nice bluetooth speaker too this sounds very nice <laughs>